Everybody out of the car. Who else is in that car with you? Someone got shot around here? Hey, come my way. You are watching the moment Hilliard police Step responded to dozens of shots fired Step on Weaver Court where people were playing soccer Keep inside. Coming. One teenager was hurt in the shooting, and this is one of the first incidents recorded by new body worn cameras for Hilliard police. Since TV's Lacey Chris shows us what happened. Watch this Hilliard dash camera video of chaos as dozens of shots were fired early morning last Friday. We know it was more than 20. Um, there were several, several uh, rounds that struck the uh, victim's car and then struck the facility itself. Hilliard Police Chief Mike Woods explains a 17 year old was injured in the shooting, but police don't know if he was targeted or was hit by a stray bullet. Hilliard Police are still investigating what led up to the shooting. I don't know if it was a shootout. Uh, we do believe there was one, more than one person firing a weapon that night. Um, you know, more than one, could be two, could be three, but uh, that, that'll be part of what we're trying to determine. Woods says the group was there playing soccer at an indoor stadium. I, I think when we spoke briefly with the owner, uh, he has some evenings where he tries to keep it open. Uh, I believe his thought was to give the kids a place to go to, uh, to keep them off the street. Woods says okay. while these types of shootings are rare, this, this was the right first here. incident of its kind since Hilliard started using body-worn cameras. You know, looking at it, there's there's a couple things that are helping with the investigation. You know, uh, we're able to match some names to the faces because we have that. Uh, but what it really assured me was that my officers were doing a good job. In Hilliard, Lacey Crisp, 10 TV News. Hilliard police ask if you saw anything or you have video of the incident, give them a call.